a screen and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is Chapter 8, Joseph Forgive His Brothers, Genesis 42-45. Let's read. Joseph's brothers were not good to him. They did, they did bad things to him because of the Joseph had hurt had hard times in Egypt, but God was with Joseph. God helped him. God gave Joseph wisdom. God gave him a ruler of Egypt. Joseph forgave his brothers. So his brother, like, sold Joseph as a slave, but Joseph was like forgiving his brother as joseph said they had seven good years with god's help joseph saved up, up crops after that seven bad years followed but they had plenty of food in Egypt. So, as Joseph said, like God, as God has told Joseph, there were seven good years, and then there were also had seven bad years. But the Egypt was, they had plenty of food because. Joseph already knew that. The brothers met the governor in the palace. They didn't know what the Egyptian governor was, Joseph. Joseph's brother wanted to buy some food. Uh, Joseph's brother thought that Joseph was dead. Joseph knew they were his brothers. <clears throat> Joseph said, you're the spies. You want to know how much food we have. The brothers were shocked. They said in fear, no, we are here to buy food. So the brother like, met the governor. Joseph. Joseph was charge of the food. So like but his brother came one day and but they the brothers didn't know that Joseph was the governor. And they wanted to buy some food. Joseph want to know if they still hate one another. Bring your youngest brother next time and prove that you're not spies. Joseph saw that they cared uh, for Benjamin. Benjamin. He saw them help one another. Keep Benjamin safe. Joseph wanted to to ask them. But his frog and Benjamin but he decided to not ask he gave them enough food to left let them go to their hometown so like Joseph saw his family the brothers and he was like Joseph wanted to know that they still hate one another. And they said, like, then bring your youngest son, Benjamin. Like, and Joseph wanted to, like, ask about his father and Benjamin. But he didn't ask because, like, he should, like, not ask so they will not. Thing that's weird. 
Joseph's brother to came to Egypt to buy food again. They didn't recognize Joseph. Joseph couldn't help crying. When he saw his brothers again, Brothers, I am Joseph. The brothers were scared. They thought that they have that have be killed. But Joseph said, It's all right, brothers. God sent me to Egypt before you. Let's live here in Egypt. Joseph forgave his brothers. They lived happily together. So, Joseph invited his brothers. Chapter 9 Brave Miriam. Miriam was an Israel girl. Her family lived in Egypt. The Pharaoh of Egypt didn't like the people of Israel. The Pharaoh ordered his men to kill all the Israel baby boys. Miriam's mother had a lovely baby boy. She had the baby and raised him. So like um the so Israel were living in Egypt. And one day, Paro like, thought that Israel was like getting stronger, so he decided to kill the kill the baby boy. As the baby grew, she couldn't hide him, hide them anymore. She laid her son in a basket and placed it him in the river. So like, as the baby grew, like they couldn't hide him anymore. Like and he will like cry also. So she laid her son in a basket and placed it him to a river. I will be with the boy," said Miriam. Miriam was a brave girl. Miriam followed the basket secretly. So Miriam, like, was with the baby. The baby cried in the basket. A woman came to the river, and took a bed. She was a princess of Egypt. Look at this basket. She was surprised to see a baby in the basket. I will raise this cute baby myself. So like, the baby cried in the basket. And like suddenly the Egypt princess like sighed. And like she said, like he, she will like raise the cute baby, self. The princess said, "I will call this baby Moses because I took him out of the water. Moses means a child of of the water. I need nurse." Worry the princess. Miriam was watching everything. She ran to the princess and said, Look, I know a woman. She can help you. The mother can take care of the baby, said Miriam. The princess said yes. The, and Miriam brought her mother. The princess asked her, I will pay you for nursing my baby. The mother were very happy to raise her own baby openly. Thank you. You were such a brave girl, Miriam, said the mother.
Yes, today I read the Bible story to enjoy the next time I'll read another good story. Then let's see you next time. Bye!